Michelle Bendy here, and <laughs> we know who we are, but you might not have known. So this is Walk the Plank, which Lolly just geniusly came up with. So you're going to go through your whips? Yes. <laughs> and I'm going to go through the stuff I have kitted up, which is like, we might not, we might not have time for this. There might not be time for this. But I'm trying to think the amount that you've got kitted up. Do you want to see? Wait, let me, since I now have my camera perfect, let me go ahead and move it. Do you see all this? Shut up. That is not all kitted up. That's all kitted up. That's my work stuff. But like this, yeah, it's at least, it's all at least partially kitted. And I think it's like all mostly kitted. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a hoarder. I have a hoard. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like Smaug. And yeah. See, mine's not that bad, so I've got two boxes of whips. That's not that bad. How many whips, how many whips total? Did you count? I've been getting that question a lot lately. How many whips do you have? And I'm like, I don't, okay, I don't I've want got to know. A... Um, actually, no, I don't. Well, we can keep, I'll, I'll keep tally. Wait, let me get a pen and pencil. I'll keep tally while you, uh. I'll keep track of how many you're keeping and how many you're getting rid of. So, okay, should I go through what I'm getting rid of? Oh, um, you already decided? So I've gone through them. Okay. And I've been pretty cutthroat about it. <laughs> okay, now why, why? Like, is it just because you have too many or you, some of them you don't like anymore? Um, so, stitching on into the jungle. Uh-huh. And I'm like, why am I stitching it? Why am I actually stitching it? Got it. Got it. I have that moment every now and then too, right? Like, okay, why? <laughs> like, what am I going to do? You can't answer it. There's no yeah. logical answer to it. So, I've gone through them, separate them out. Okay. Pretty cutthroat. So, I think I need like a, a backup of you make it. Right. <laughs> like, have I been too cutthroat or is this okay? Yeah. Okay, I'm here. I'm here for it. Let's do this. So, this is a lot. Um, All right. I'm excited. So, most of these are mania starts. Of course. So, they're not that bad to get rid of. Okay. So, they're only like a couple stitches. It's not like you four pages into a hate and you're like, I hate this now. Okay. No. So the first one is Happy Halloween. Okay. By Silver Creek Samplers. Now I do like it. Uh-huh. But I don't think I'm going to finish it. So I like it too. So I'm just going to put that out there right now. This might be a hard sell. <laughs> and that's all I've done. Uh, that, right? that is the right way. <laughs> that's going to be big. Yes, yeah, gonna... so it's going to be quite big. That's another thing. I only wanted it small. Yeah, that's going to be like wall hanging big. Mm, yeah. Yeah, I say get rid of it. I think if you, like, if it were smaller. I'd probably do it if it was smaller. Yeah, so maybe like make a pile for like someday I'll restart. So you're not going to like totally get rid of the chart. You're just going to, or are you totally getting rid of the chart? <laughs> Who gets rid of charts? What are we talking about? Who are we? What? <laughs> um, but I'll probably, to be fair, the piece of fabric that I did it on was a really awkward, long stretch of fabric. Oh yeah, that's strange. So I can just... Is that a 28? 32. You should just restart it on the other side over one. I know how you like your 28 count over one. <laughs> Just saying. It's 32 though. I'm not doing 32 over one. Oh, no, no. Only if you were doing 10th stitch. Even then, I don't think. Mm -mm. Nope. No. Okay. So that okay. one's. That's yeah, one that's down. Cool. One get rid of. The next one um, was another mania start. It was this one. Oh, which I do like. Yeah. But. I don't know where to put it. 
I'm so, you know what? I'm actually kind of shocked you don't have like a flamingo wall or a flamingo room or a Florida the, hallway. The, the living room's kind of tropical uh -huh. from the last time we redid it. But we'll probably redo it after Christmas. Mm -hmm. So. So then there won't be anywhere. Yeah, no. Plus the look on your face when you're talking about it, you're like. Yeah, no. I don't like <laughs> It, I, th I don't know. I've not done the well, I did a fair bit. Not that much. Oh. Yeah, I don't... I don't know if I like the colours in it. Where's it gone? I thought the, that was, like, all yellow. Uh-huh. But it's not. What was it? It was pink. You just held it up, right? We're getting rid of this one. So that one. Yeah, just because, like, the last one, the one when you held up the Halloween one, I felt like you were torn, like you wanted to stitch it, yeah. but you also wanted to get rid of it. And this one, you're like, I don't want to stitch this. <laughs> no. So, I'll reuse that fabric. Oh, definitely. It's sparkly. What do you do? Um, do, you just, do you just take a seam ripper to it and just, like... Yeah, so those two are both two over two, so that'll be easy to pull yeah. out. I don't think I've got any one over ones. Oh, do not pick out. If you, like, no. You cut that fabric and throw it away. <laughs> so the next two, I fear you're going to say that I should keep them. <laughs> okay. Or maybe I could just send it to you and you could stitch them. Because I don't have very much to stitch at all. Not at all. So this one, oh, I've got the full pan. Damn it. It was the Stormtrooper one. <laughs> now this one is one over one. Oh, yeah, I don't want that then. Get rid of it. I'm just kidding. Let's see it. <laughs> and the thing is, so I like the thread. Yeah. But you can't, you can't, you can't see it. You can't see it. <laughs> So I like the thread and I like the fabric, but I don't love them together. No. I'm not stitching that for you. <laughs> I love you dearly, but I'm not stitching that for you. Um, so would you just change the thread, just change the fabric, stitch it again, let it cool off? I don't know. I think stitching it two over two might be too big. It's big, right? Is, I, that's, is that the, that's the stitch line? Yeah. So 128 by 143. And on 14k count, it says it'll be 23 by 25 centimeters. So for Americans, <laughs> that's nine inches by 10 inches, about. Um, which is quite big. Which is pretty big. I mean, it's not going to fit in an eight by 10 frame that way but if you did it on 16 count or 32 count it would be what'd you say how many stitches 120 right 128 by 143 143 so the long dimension oh wait I can't calculate her <laughs> well it's still you would need to do it like so if you did it on 16 count, you could fit it in an eight by 10 frame. It would be close to the edges. You'd have like a half an inch on each side. Yeah. You could fit it. Um, but look at your face. Do you really want to? I don't know if you really want to. Get rid of it. Keep the thread though. Keep the thread. Keep the thread and the fabric. I think I should do an ornament on that if I cut. There's no way I'm unstitching that. Um, so I can cut it off. No, don't pick that up. Yeah, that's, that just became a small. That was the thread. Mm. Mm. Oh, that's, that's color and cotton, isn't it? Dang, I don't have that one. That's beautiful. I like that one. I'm going for a complete collection of color and cottons. I think I'm just going to start telling Angela, like, just, I mean, there's not that many. How, how many is there? I don't know. You say not that many. <laughs> no, I said there's not that many because, you know, I'm the master of understatement. It's just a hate. It's not that big. Won't take that long. I'll be done with this in a couple days. 
Hello. Um, so the next one was just a star that I wanted to do. It's another Star Wars one. <laughs> Why are you getting rid of all the Star Wars? I don't know. I think this one, I just chose the wrong threads for the fat. Blah, 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 for the fabric. So it's the, um, that one. Okay, yeah. You know which one. Yeah. And I started using the new DMC colours. Oh. Mm. On this fabric. Oh, I love that fabric. And I stitched it one over one. I think there's one my problem is. I think, I think we're sensing a theme. Don't do one over one. Don't do one over one. But look at the tiny attacks. Oh my gosh. So you know what you could do with this one? This is what you're going to do with this one. You're going to cut out that symbol and the tiny at, -AT and you're going to make it into a scissor fab or something. Yes. And then it's a finish. So it's not like you're giving up on a whip. You finished something. Because that's adorable. It is or, cute. Or a needle minder. You could even make that little tiny thing into a needle minder. Mm. That would be adorbs. I can do that. Hold it up again. Because mm. there's a lot more to go, right? Yeah. <laughs> They're just so freaking cute. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to say, figure out a way to turn that little at, -AT into a finish. Yeah, I'm torn because I think, how big would it be? Uh, that was 136 by 112. That's decent size. What are you stitching it on? 28 over 1? Yep. So you could do it over 2 and it would still be almost... 10. What is 10? What is an 8 by 10 for me? Is that A4 for you? I gotta Google this. Inch. Yeah. Inches are the same? No, no, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> it's still 8 by 10. <laughs> no, I mean, like, what is it in your parlance? Like, what would you call it? Because we just... Do you guys just have 8 by 10 frames? Because we don't have A4 frames or whatever. A whatever oh so <laughs> it, i guess it kind of depends you can get like standard eight by ten frames okay but then a lot of the frames that you can get are a4 yeah because people print an a4 and frame it apparently okay a3 a4 jeez it's too complicated i can't anyway I think you should make a needle minder out of that little guy. I think I still want to stitch it there on a uh, on two by uh, two over two on something. I agree. Who knows? Why are you stitching everything one over one? Is your fabric not big enough, or are you just crazy? I was trying to use fabrics that I had. Ah. <laughs> uh. See, I was trying to be good. Okay. I have way too much fabric, so maybe we'll do a, <laughs> we should do another chat where I go through your fabric, or my fabric, and I'm like, do you want this? Do you want this? Do you want this? No. <laughs> yeah, I'll send them to you in Florida. It'll be in your Florida box with your mug. And so then I... <laughs> You're like, I'm ignoring you. <laughs> ignoring you. Oh, Citrovia, right? Project's half done. <laughs> I think... How far, okay, let's see how far you are. Uh. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is a mania start though. Yeah. One over one again? No, that one's no. two over two. two over. Okay. So what if you what if you leave that part like it is? And just stitch the words, no background, and then frame it. Like, frame it half done. 
Do you know what I mean? Which bits? So just stitch like, I would stitch like I'm working on my, but none of the banner. And then maybe just do the shadowing of PhD in cross stitch project half done and then leave everything else off and frame it. So the project itself is like half done. Do you know what I mean? I like that idea. Cause like, and of course it's not my idea. I just recycle everyone else's ideas. McKenna was stitching. Um, what was she stitching? Uh, Dragons of Sumatra or one of the big long dog samplers. And she just framed like a tiny piece of it when she got sick of it. It's a finish. I say, I say stitch a little bit more of that and call it a finish. Okay. We'll keep that one. I'm putting that under the key. So far we've gotten rid of four and only kept one. That's good. I love that. The big one. This is pirates. <gasps> oh. So. That's a heck of a my, project. That's my theory with that one. And I'm not a big project kind of person because, again, what am I going to do with it? Let's be honest. What am I going to do with it? <laughs> <clears throat> I like the artwork. Yeah. However. Um, <laughs> Rosie's paging me. Can you hear her in the background? <laughs> Can you please come here? That's all I've done. Oh, get rid of it. You know um, what? Get rid of it and frame the cover page. Oh, that fabric is so fantastic. You can use that fabric for 800 other fantastic things. Exactly. Yeah, that one's gone. End of discussion. If you want to keep the artwork, then just frame the front of the package and be done with it. So then it's great. That's it. Now you have all the fabric. Now you can stitch everything to over to. But now I can put all the threads back. Yeah, which is huge. That's a lot of threads. That is a lot of threads. Did you buy that as a kit? And then just take out, no, that came. That was a. Could you, I, and now you can use the project bag for something else. Or you can yes. send it to me. I could send it to you. I'm just putting it out there. No, I don't. <laughs> I don't need any more project bags. You don't need anything else. I need nothing. I need less. I, what I need is less. Uh, next one I'm not sure on because I want to do the collection, but they're not my style. Mm. And I'm not sure. Oh, strawberry fields forever. Okay. How much have you got? Have you started it? You started it. I started it and it's one over one. <laughs> I'm going to send you, I'm sending you fabric. I'm done with you. I'm not even going to ask you. I'm just going to send you a bunch of fabric. Forget it. You get what you get. So, I mean, it's cute and it's on fabric that I dyed. So, it's cute. Uh -huh. And it's cute one over one. It's adorable. Who finished? Um, Somebody stitch, else finished one over Stitching one. Social. One of the sisters on Stitching Social finished it one over one and it's adorable. Tiny. Tiny. Oh my gosh, look how much border you've done. <sighs> so that's my problem. <laughs> that's quite a lot of border. That is a lot. I mean, there's a lot more. To be fair, there's a lot more to go on that project. Yeah, um, nowhere near started, really, when you really think about it. Yeah, yeah. I don't know, because it's not, it's really not your style. No. But it's really cute. See, I was going to stitch one of them. Well, I can't remember which one. Are you going to do the submarine? Yeah, and I was going to do it for my dad, because he lives like Paul McCartney, blah, 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 and whatever. And then when I showed him one, he was just like, yeah, yeah. Ah. Oh. <laughs> well, never mind that. No thoughtful gift going in here then. Yeah. Um, that's not something I'm going to spend 394 hours on. No. Nope. So I don't know. I don't know what to do. I think I'm going to just count it. You're going to, you're going to bin it? Oh. 
then if I really want to do it again, I can just, I'll keep it, but in the bottom of the fabric box. There you go. Don't, I, I say UFO for now. UFO for now. Don't, yeah. don't keep it active, but like, don't get rid of it yet. Okay. Now the next one, I don't know if you've already not, been, not, um, what's the word I'm looking for? <laughs> you've already UFO'd it? <laughs> oh, have I given, maybe I've given up. Oh. I bought the new one. <laughs> because this. <laughs> I bought the have new one. No, I did No, I haven't started it. The, you know what I was thinking? Um, the Halloween one ends like in three days. The last part comes out on the 17th. Um, and I'm going to need this to help with my hangover of that. Because I'm going to be so distraught when that's over. But there's so much house on that. There's so much house on this. And tree. There's a lot of background on this. There is a lot. Can so you you're saying no to this one. <laughs> is that what you're saying? I would say no. That's why I've not done it. Purely because of the amount of house. So I'm on the fence. I'm on the fence with last year's too, because if I'm going to do this one, then I don't need to do last year's. But I also, last year's is cute. It's really cute. It is. I don't like Santa's skinny legs. Uh, see, I didn't even get that far. <laughs> <laughs> it's cute, yeah. And this is what I took to Vegas with me. And that's all I've got. Over one again. Yeah. I'm, I'm sensing a theme here. I don't know if you're sensing a theme. Apparently, I don't like doing one over one. But this is 25 count fabric. Oh, that's a little better. Not that much better. Three count better. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm having the same problem you're having. I think maybe. So I could just do that bit, finish this bit, and put the border around. You but could, and then it would be a cute little winter... Hold it up again? Is it small enough to make an ornament if you do that? It would be a cute little winter flat fold. Yeah, so I could do it like... Um... That might be too big. Something like that. Oh yeah, you could totally do that. That would be cute. What if you... I just did the bear and the trees. Yeah. What if you took out the side, the white stuff on the side, and just left the white stuff across the top? Would that be weird? No. And you could always, like, replace the candy cane with another peppermint, and then done. Because you can't really see the white on this fabric, which is what annoyed me as well. Yeah. No, maybe just take out the, take out all the border and then just make a little ornament out of those guys. Cause that would be cute. Finish the bear's legs though. That's creepy without legs. <laughs> I was going to say, wait, you got legs? <laughs> yeah, he has legs. He has legs. Yeah. Yeah. That's cute. Do that. Make it into an ornament or a little, make it into a little thing like your gnome. I like that. Right so we're going to keep that and finish it as is. I want, I think, I feel like I want, I'm going to put a modified finish category. Look, at this is very technical how I'm keeping track of you right here. <laughs> post-its for the win. Post-its, always post-its. Now this bit. What's next? <laughs> <laughs> there was a cut. We had to... <laughs> Whatever. So, um, no, Pretty little no. Hawaii... This is a dense, I said this before, but this is a deceptively dense project. I'm always... Pretty full coverage. It's pretty full coverage. There's not much empty space in there. It's really pretty. Is this one, wait, I think this is one, I'm doing this 28 count over one, and you're not. You're not. I'm not. I'm not the one making the mistake this time. 
No, that's me. That's because I wanted to put it on a piece of the, you sent me some Jodery Designs fabric, the sparkly, and I wanted it on there and it was like just, and of course I oriented this one incorrectly as well. But it's so small, it doesn't matter. Oh, psh, give it up. That's hardly done. Reuse no. that fabric. It's not something fun to hang up anywhere. Yeah. And that's the thing, right? Is like, where am I going to put this? What am I going to do with it? Or like, do I love stitching it? Some of mine, like I love stitching so much that I'm willing to stitch them and then give them away to someone. Yeah. But like, if you don't love stitching it, then what's the point? Like you're, you, you'll get zero enjoyment because you won't get to have it and you don't enjoy stitching it. So. That's kind of how I feel about frosted pumpkin. Lately, yeah. Into the jungle. Oh, yeah. It, and that's big. Um, it is big. And I'm not going to not finish it. <laughs> no, you're so close. Are you caught up now? Because um, you're close. What did you finish? The two cans? Yeah. So I've done those. So you just have the rest of the words and then the two boxes that are left. Yeah. I'm not doing the bottom banner. No. Again, why? But then I'm just like, I'm not going to hang this anywhere, so. Is there any backstitching on that? Nope. How big is it going to be? Um, please hold. <laughs> on cue, snap that for me. I don't know whether to like give it away to someone or I don't know. What if you do something like put it on a tote bag or make it into a project bag or Yeah, maybe. Eh. I'm not I'm not sensing you loving that. Oh, it's not that big. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what you're reading. And they're not big boxes. You could always um You could, so Starlight Stitchery in Corvallis, because they just reopened, like they used to be Friendship Crossing and they reopened and everybody who stitched models for Friendship Crossing kind of took them back and blah, blah, blah. Um, they're taking projects, like you can send them your finishes and they will display it in the shop as a model and put it on consignment. So it's an idea, like you'd have to ship it to Oregon. But I mean, so you ship it to me, I frame it for you. We give it to Friendship Crossing. They use it as a shop model, put a price yeah. tag on it, and then you get some cash. It's an idea. It's a very good idea. I didn't think about that. Yeah, work all the angles. All the angles. Because then it's out of my hands. <laughs> and if somebody, and it's doing the shop good, right? Thank you. You're welcome. Friendship Crossing, you're one Starlight Stitcher, you're welcome. And if somebody buys it, Cash money. I mean, you'll never get back what you put in, blah, 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 time and effort, but it's out of your house and cash money. Or probably PayPal, actually, but whatever. Same thing. Yeah. It's still real money. It spends like cash, trust me. <laughs> so, the last one. The last one? Yeah. Okay. The last one? I have a lot. I have the whips that I'm keeping. But oh, we'll these are just the ones that we think you're, okay, okay. Yeah. I was these like, you only have 10 whips? That's, no, you have more than that. Just that's, I only have 10 accounted for. <laughs> you laugh every time you do that. You're like, I'm gonna get in trouble. I'm about to get in trouble. <laughs> I'm not. Oh! Now, have you started this? I have twice started that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so I have, like, if you look on part two, I have the little witch with the scissors and some yeah. of the vine behind her. That's all I've done. You've done more than me, I think. You're hosting that Sal. It's okay because I'm hosting sales that I'm not working on too. So I, I spent a lot on the fabric, obviously, for this picture, this plus ale. Ooh, that's a nice one. 
I'm already leaning towards to get rid of it because you can use ale for so many things. Right? So many things. Oh, okay. Send me your floss for the vines and get rid of it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, why? Is it is it one over one again? No. Oh, okay, okay. That's always going to be my first question now. Is this one over one? Is this why we don't like it? No, this is two over two. I really like it. You don't, you're just not feeling it. No. Again, it's not my style. I don't like get rid of it. Yeah, get rid of it. It's more of the, the whole style thing. Yeah. A mystery release. But yeah, not love it. Get rid of it. Done. Get rid so of it. I can pick that one and save the fabric. Yeah. I like it. Wow, you were, you were, uh, That's good. good. You're flat out getting rid of seven and UFOing one and thinking about a modified finish on two. Yeah. That's really good. That's 10. Done. Gone. So, I mean, that's not too bad. No, it's good. Um, yeah, most of them you can pick out, so that's even better. But you still have stuff to work on, so you'll be fine. I don't even know what's in there. I've totally canned the bubble thing. Yeah. Because there's no way. A, I cannot. <laughs> I just can't stitch on Ada. <laughs> oh, no? No more. Done. I just can't do it. So I'm just like, there's no way I, I'm going to get it finished. Because I'd started two. Uh huh. But. Um... Yeah, and it, it, like, you know, I feel like there's a trend right now where people are realizing, like, if I don't like this, then I don't have to stitch it. Right. Or like it, I, it hurts my heart when people are like, you know, I love stitching on Ada, but I need to upgrade to linen, but I have a real, tr real trouble seeing it. I'm like, you don't have to, you know, first of all, it's not an upgrade. Second of all, you don't have to switch. Stitch what you want on what you want. Don't stitch over one on 28 if you're lolly because you're going to trash it later. <laughs> Give it six months and it'll be out the window. <laughs> Finish it or forget it. But I think everything else I'm going to keep. Oh, that's good. And most of those are styles that are going to finish. Well, I don't even know. What do you have? You have Into the Jungle, you have Guardians. You have the Haunted Mansion. That's three finishes right there. That's good. Yeah, I think that's it. I'm borderline sad about Haunted Mansion being finished. Yeah, me too. But then it's how are we going to finish them? It's going to be so cute. Oh, I've been told that mine's being turned into a wall hanging. JoLynn already. Because I was up at Acorns and Threads and I was working on it. And she came up behind me. She's like, I'm turning this into a wall hanging. And I was like, okay. So what's that thing that you sent me? You know, the... Oh, yeah, yeah. The, the wall hanger hangy thing. <laughs> that, that, that's the technical term, I believe. But that's too small for this. Oh, but yours is over one. You and your crazy over one. That might fit, actually. It might fit. If not, I don't know what I'm going to do. Well, if it doesn't, like if the, so the wall hangy thing, it goes like this, right? So it has like the opening that your stuff is supposed to slide onto. But if your piece is wider than that, then you just put a dowel through the back of your piece and hook the dowel onto that. And then your piece will just be a little wider than the hangy thing, but it'll still be super cute because the hangy thing is super cute. That's a genius idea. <laughs> I also got these the other day. I'm on a roll today. I should probably just go back to bed and call today done because yeah, so I got these the other week, and I don't know what to do with them. <laughs> oh, those are so cute. Are they hardboard? They're like wood. Tiny wood, real, real thin wood? Yeah. You don't have any Halloween smalls? What about, how close is that Barbara Anna to having a witch in it? 
Um, but you don't want to cut your piece of ale. Wow. Um, I'm gonna keep what it. a candle, it's getting out of control. <laughs> okay, it's fine. <laughs> I just see a fire coming up. <laughs> Go on. It's okay. Oh it's a little, I should have trimmed the wick. It's okay. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. If I'm not fine, I don't know what you'll do. Um, how close is the Barbara Anna to having a witch in it? Um, I mean, out of that scene, mm -hmm. it's just the witches in the house that are missing. <laughs> So bossy. <laughs> so like the one witch goes somewhere around here. Oh yeah, that's cute. And the house, and then another witch here. So what if you, because the house is big, right? What if you put the little witch where she goes and then put a couple more witches on the hill and then cut it out and put it on one of those pumpkins? And then you have a finish. And it's a sampler because it says ABC. I mean, just an idea. I don't know if it will fit. Can just put a really big pumpkin here. Gigantic pumpkin. Huge pumpkin. There has to be another motif that you can pick out of that piece somewhere that you can slap in there. I have to look at the rest of it because I've not, I've not looked at the rest of it since part well, two and three were released. If you're not going to stitch it, then you don't. <laughs> don't waste the paper, right? Nope. Um, just an, I just love that vine so much. I hate to see the vine. Then again, it would, that would leave you with a nice big piece of ale that you haven't cut any. Yeah, just rip it out, whatever. I was grasping for straws. Grasp, clutching at those straws. Yeah. So that's it. That's That was good, though. Ten? Yeah. I think... Yeah, that's definitely it. Yeah, and I agree. I, I agree. I think all of them. All of them are good to get rid of.